Hey, we're more than a week into the new year, and if you made a resolution, how are you doing? Well, Riley Nagel has some tips to help you keep your new year, new you mentality. Gyms like the Cycle Bar are always packed at the beginning of the year, but keeping up that gym routine can be easier said than done. Riley, turn it up and run! You got eight seconds left! Michael Hornig, the general manager and lead instructor for Cycle Bar, has years of experience pushing his clients to reach their potential. Four, three, two, and seven. You come here, you should have fun. You should not come here dreading it. You should not walk out of here dreading it. We want you to have as much fun as possible. Hornig says around Christmas time, they were concerned about the lack of new members, but once January hit, Within our first six days of being open in the new year, we sold 15 additional memberships, which usually we sell 15 in about 30 to 45 days, and we did it in six days. Hornig says right now they've been able to retain their new clients, but understands the first week of the new year can be the toughest time to manage a new routine. And then it comes to day six, and you're like, um, actually I'm going to skip that one. I spoke with two members who say they joined the gym together back in July. They say life knocked them off their schedule, but they're back at it, motivating each other. And I think having an accountability partner really helps you, like, because you have somebody to push you. If it's just you, you can be like, nah, I don't, I, I'm going to sleep. I, I'll do it later, and then the later never comes, and I'm too tired later. So. Hornig says their gym philosophy of being a community and having fun while exercising helps his clients to come in day after day. He advises those struggling to create their own healthy habits to treat your body right before and after workouts. He says staying hydrated and eating well goes a long way. It's like a little puzzle piece. You have, you're eating good, you're feeling good, and then it all just clicks together. More advice, he says being willing to start is a good first step and remind yourself of the changes you want to see. Why did you start? Why on January 1st did you make that resolution? Reporting in Chattanooga, I'm Riley Nagel, Local 3 News.